zone is sectioned off, sir. Please step back. Agent Nahman Jaden, FBI. You got a badge or something, Mr. Jaden? Yeah. Yeah, of course. Check. You can pass. I'm looking for Lieutenant Blake. Is he around? I saw him arrive earlier. He's here somewhere. Thanks. Video memo recording, Agent 47023, Nam and Jaden, Tuesday, October 4th, 2011. Time is 8 Related to the investigation. Sample of no interest. Comes from one of the policemen present on the waste room. of blood detected on the fence behind the railroad line. The blood report indicates an advanced and long-lasting state of exhaustion. There's a good chance that they're the killers. Very common. Tire tracks on the side of the road behind the railroad line. It may be the killer's car.
Very common. Traces of footprints leading toward the body. They don't look like those of the police. No correlation with the body for the moment. Harry, come in. Traces of blood on the railroad train. cat. The FBI doesn't keep files on dead cats. Not yet. Comment, sample of no interest. Comes to one of the policemen present on the wasteland. Harry, comment, sample of no interest. Comes to one of the policemen present on the wasteland. Some orchid pollen. The concentration of pollen in the air is quickly decreasing because of the rain, but it gets higher in the direction of the body. Major Norman Jaden from the FBI. I went by your office this morning, they told me to be here. Now, if you're looking for rain, dead bodies, and highways, you come to the right place. Mike, will you tell that asshole with the bulldozer to stop for five minutes? I can't hear myself think here. Right away, Lieutenant. Well, are you coming, Jaden? So, what happened? Some guy taking his dog for a piss found a body about 6 o'clock this morning. We don't know much more right now. Based on what we've seen, looks like the work of the origami killer. Has the body been identified? No, not yet. We should know more later today. Any news on the coroner? He's on his way, Lieutenant. We've been waiting for an hour, for fuck's sake. There are a lot of people on the crime scene. Aren't you afraid your men might destroy some clues? You don't find proof sitting behind a desk. We're not in the habit of trampling things into the ground, even if we're not in the FBI. No. No, of course not. That's... that's not what I meant. Tony! I don't want to see a single shit-stirring journalist within a mile of here. You got it? Yes, Lieutenant. Do we know the cause of death? There are no marks on the body. Chances are he was drowned, like the others. Listen, you look busy. Do you mind if I have a look around? Be my guest. Hey, Jaden. You come and see me if you find anything, okay? We're on the same team now.
Harry comment, the victim is lying on his back. No visible signs of violence. Superficial wound on the right thigh. The blood is identical to that on the fence. His face is covered with mud, like the other victims. An orchid was placed on the victim's chest. A small origami figure in the right hand. Fingers were probably closed after the time of death. The victim is Jeremy Bowles, declared missing five days ago. See reference file. Think I've seen all there is to see. I'm gonna leave. I see you in the office, right? Okay. See you later. <laughs>